Today's episode is being sponsored by Bidesi's West Indian Supermarket. I'd like to say a special thank you to Miss Sita Bidesi for sponsoring all of the items that you've been seeing me using. Now they have locations in Lauder Hill, in Orlando, Canada and New York. So I'll leave their website down below in the description box so you all make sure and check them out. So thank you Miss Sita Bidesi for sponsoring this episode. I already washed my sorrel ahead of time and what I'm doing now is cutting the sorrel up into strips. I find doing this before you boil it actually helps the process to move along faster. So you want to cut it as thin as possible. Next place, into, place it into a pot and cover with enough water. We want to bring this up to a boil to allow those petals or sepals to soften. Once soft, drain that liquid out and place the petals into a container and place it out into the sun so that the, the liquid or the water content can dry out. If you wanted to skip that step, you can. Once it's nice and dry like this, we're going to go in with some BDC's mustard oil. Some chopped hot peppers and pimento peppers and some minced garlic. Now this, you want to mix it and place it onto your stove and bring it up to a bubble. You want that oil to heat through. Once it heats through and it's very fragrant, pour it onto the sorrel. But you also want to add some salt at that same time. Add salt to taste. You can always adjust after. Next, go in with some Amchar powder and I'm using the Caribbean Flavors brand and some Jira powder. Toss to combine, toss well, taste and adjust your salt after and then this would be ready to be served. It's as simple as this guys and I promise you, you're going to love it. Remember as I said, if you want to skip the drying process, you can. Um, if you make this, let me know down below if you like it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!